Hey there guys, um, I'm doing a video today and I'm adding some lights, uh, some some deck lights right now to uh, my boat. Um, and they're these, these cool LED boat, bolt lights. Um, they're from uh, osnium.com. Um, they're, uh, they're flush mounted LED bolts. I got the stainless steel ones, um, you know, being on the water, they're going to see some, some, uh, some weather and whatnot. Um, they do make, uh, aluminum ones. Um, I ended up picking these up for eleven ninety nine uh, per, per bolt. And, um, I got red. And they come with a really nice, long um, leader cable, basically. And uh, they've got two screws here, or two two nuts here that you can back off. And I'm going to be basically putting these in the in the gunnel of my boat. Um, so I'm going to kind of go through the process of that, and I'm going to actually have these these two nuts off, so it's sitting flush. You know, sitting flush just like that in the uh, in the gunnel. So I'm gonna go over the process of that and uh, wiring up, and hopefully we'll see a finished product. Um, and then also, uh, I think I'm gonna make a, a separate video for doing um, a couple lights under my consoles, and, and I'm debating on doing the rear deck as well. I, I bought enough for all of that, but um, today we're just gonna start with the. Uh, with the front deck so I'm gonna be doing three on each side uh, that's six total lights these are a three watt light um, the aluminum ones that they make are a one watt light so uh, I, I will show a comparison in this video of um, the difference between the one watts and the three watts the three watts for the extra five dollars I think they were are worth it um, and then they're they're stainless steel uh, also, these these aren't the ones with the lenses. The stainless steel does not come with the lenses, and they only come in an 11 millimeter bolt, which for me is is perfect. You know, you you won't even really notice them on here. But uh, we'll go ahead and get started with this and and uh, get them all wired up today. All right. So when drilling these out, I'm using a 3 8 inch drill bit. Um, I don't have a 7 16 but basically the uh, diameter across here, the base where the threads are, um, is approximately 7 sixteenths of an inch. And I'm just using a 3 8 and kind of uh, widening it out little by little um, just so that way you know, I don't mess up. I only have one shot to do this and I want these to be in here nice and tight. Um, just from putting them in, then we're going to go ahead and epoxy them in. But uh, I'm using a 3 8 drilling it out, um, doing about 2 inches up on on the first two and then a little bit lower on the on the second one so we'll go ahead and get started here um, the biggest thing is uh, take your time and you know you only get only get one shot at this so definitely take your time cut and all my lights roughly set in um, what I'm gonna do now is uh, take just a bit of silicone and silicone around them and then actually I have enough to hook uh, the little nuts on the back of them um, so they don't come off but uh, overall I'm pretty happy on how these turned out um, kind of check them out here you know they're, they're nice and, and set in um, they're they're pretty flush, you know, for the most part. So I'm not really worried about anything uh, catching on them. <clears throat> and uh, you know, they look they look pretty good. So you can see that in there. I'm just gonna get them, you know, set fully in there and uh, silicone them up. 
Um, and then we'll start wiring it. And uh, <clears throat> I'm going to let them set for a little bit just so that uh, everything can kind of adhere and and uh, don't have to worry about pulling any uh, pulling anything out or jogging anything loose. So um, we'll come back here in a little bit and uh, wire it up after we're all done doing some silicone. All right, well, I'm all done with the install. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm uh, I'm sitting out here on the boat. Um, I'm actually on the step right now, and I got my two lights pretty much right to the side of me that are that are doing a pretty good job of uh, of illuminating the deck. Um, I think overall, you know, this is uh, this is definitely going to be a a sweet added factor on the boat, and it's going to really help out for some night fishing. Um, you know, really, I've got probably four hours worth of time into it um so it really wasn't too bad you know i uh i think for the hundred bucks i have into it and a little bit of time um i'm gonna really really enjoy it and i think these are you know the lights being stainless steel um all the wires hidden up in the gunnel these are uh these are gonna last a long time probably last the life of me owning this boat so <clears throat> um i think i'm I'm pretty happy to uh, to show some of my friends. I think they're gonna be pretty jealous about it. But uh, you know, overall, overall the project turned out pretty good. It was kind of a pain in the butt um, doing the wiring and oh, hiding the wires up in the gunnel just because of uh, just because of the fit that I had to get up in there and I had to kind of get my hand up in there. And uh, that was that was kind of a pain. Um, that was probably the hardest part, besides the fact of uh, I'm drilling holes in my boat. And that's another uh, a hard thing to get over, but all in all, it's really not that bad. Um, they're not too hard to do. They're not too hard uh, to where you know if you mess up, you can fix it pretty easily. But um, if you got some basic wiring knowledge, I think this is uh, this is definitely a pretty cool project. So I'll grab them and I'll show you. <clears throat> You can see the whole front deck. There's under the compartments or under the consoles. And that's the whole front deck right there. So, really lit up. I really enjoyed doing this project. Um, I think uh, I think I'm gonna have some friends asking me to do the same thing on their boat. Well, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, I sure enjoyed making it, and uh, if you guys enjoy watching these and, and um, you know if you have any questions or comments just let me know and uh, and hopefully you like it so until next time thanks yeah, well, yeah.